Now let's discuss on how to process payment transactions with your suppliers. To proceed with it, you need to first tap on the burger icon, then select stock, then tap on the supplies option. To process the payments, you need to tap on payment pending tab. Select the supplier for which you want to process the payment. Select the payments tab. A list of purchase orders and the corresponding pending amount gets displayed. Now let's assume you have received a purchase order but some products tend to be defective and hence you return it back and you would like to collect the refund money. If you see in such a scenario a collect tab will be displayed next to that purchase order. So let's select that purchase order. Tap on collect payment. Now let's assume if the supplier has refunded you in the form of cash. You can select the cash option. The amount will be pre-filled and then you can tap on save payment. The payment details get updated. Now let's assume you have received the goods and the goods tend to be in good condition and there is no question of any refunding. Now you need to pay for those goods as well. In such a scenario, you can see the pending tag next to that purchase order. So select that purchase order and tap on make payment. Select any mode of payment. You can either make a full payment or a partial payment. For example, you can add another payment mode. The remainder amount gets preferred. You will see that the amount pending tends to be zero. Finally, tap on save payment. The payment details get updated. Hence, in this way, you can process payment of various purchase orders with your suppliers with ease. Thanks for watching. We hope that this video was helpful to you. If you have any questions, you can comment below or contact our customer support team. For more videos, subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for further updates.